side is to find the right answers to four basic questions. The first question being, when do I start giving fluids? Because the best fluid is probably the one that has not been given to the patient. Next, I want to know when do I need to stop giving fluids because we realize that fluid overload may be detrimental to organ function and patient outcome. The third question then being when do I start unloading my patient because some patients will not start flow phase spontaneously and may need some little help with hypertonic solutions and diuretics or even CVVH with ultrafiltration. And the fourth question being, when I'm unloading my patient, when do I need to stop? So it's all about finding the balance between the benefits and the risks of fluids and the benefits and the risks of unloading unnecessary fluids.